Hi, it's Vicki with Condi Systems, and in this video I want to demonstrate how to choose what format to use with templates in your digital imaging software. Here at Condi, I create four formats, and one of the formats is Adobe Illustrator, the other is a PDF, the other two formats is Photoshop, and the last is Corel Draw. So when you receive or download and save a template from our web page, what you get in your download is one of the four. Uh, I get questions sometimes about um, what format to use for your digital imaging software. And in this video, I hope to be clear and demonstrate which format to choose for Corel, Photoshop, Illustrator, um, using the Corel Draw, I'm sorry, using the templates here at Condi System. So first off, you need to log into your PartnerNet. PartnerNet is something that is that you need to register for on our PartnerNet site. You can get templates, documentation, you can get profiles, color management, um, information, instructions, sublimation instructions. PartnerNet is nothing but a support page for your needs. So templates are also included. So once you've logged into PartnerNet from Condi.com and to get there you want to click on support. Uh, you're going to log in. It's going to let you know here in green that you're logged in. If you don't have a PartnerNet login, get with your account manager. They can walk you through getting set up for that. If there's anything that you need support wise Send an email to support at condi.com. We can sometimes just email you a template or whatever you need based on your purchases here at Condi. So from the support page, you're going to click on templates is one way to get to templates. Or you can go up here and just choose the template you need based on your product number. I'm going to choose one randomly. I'm going to use the um, DSO. 31, which is a phone insert and from here I can choose one of these inserts it's going to take me to a product page from the product page I can scroll down and find my my template download it says click here to download template I'm going to click that. From here it says I can save it. So I'm going to choose to save it or I can open it. I'm just going to go ahead and save it. I'm going to view my download. And I'm going to open my downloads. This is a zip file. Everything you download from our from our Condi web page is going to be zipped. In this zip file I can right click and I can extract all. I can choose where I want to extract it to. I'm going to choose my desktop. I'm going to click OK and I'm going to extract. So now from my desktop I'm going to go and find the file that I just extracted. Okay, and there's my folder, DSO31. I'm going to open it. And I'm going to make it bigger so we can see. So here are the four files that I talked about. The DSO31.ai is Adobe Illustrator. So if you're an Adobe Illustrator user, you would just right click and open with Adobe Illustrator. Okay, and this would work with any version of Adobe. If you're a Corel Draw user, you're going to right click on the CDR file, which is Corel Draw, and you're going to left click on Open With, and you can choose. I have X6, however, I save these as version 9, and version 9 will open with any version of Corel Draw. Okay, PDF is versatile. A PDF file will open with most any application. Some of the um, 
applications uh, that you might use is would be GIMP. It may be some other applications out there uh, that PDF is kind of versatile. It will open in a lot of applications that you wouldn't think. So PDF is 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 a common file. If you ever want to email something and you don't know what someone has that they can use to open that file with, PDF is the best way to go. So it's versatile. And then finally you have a PSD, which is a Photoshop document. If you're a Photoshop user, you're going to right click on photo on the Photoshop document and then come over to open with and then choose your Photoshop. I have several several versions of Photoshop. Uh, PDF, a PSD will open. Uh, the great thing about Adobe applications is that they're versatile. You can open them in any version of, a, of Adobe Photoshop. So choose your Adobe Photoshop program and then open it using your PSD file. So again that's how you extract and open files based on your application. So, a quick demonstration, right click on PSD, open with, I have Photoshop 3, I'm going to choose that, and my template's going to open in this, be able to use it. The great thing about our templates here at Condi is that once you know the right format and you have the application that matches up with that, you can use that template in any, in any version of that application. If you want to know more in depth how to import your images into a template, look to condi.com or Condi TV. You'll be able to find videos that show how to use the templates or to place your images within those particular applications that you have. So www.conditv.com will go more in depth on how to use templates in your application. This video is strictly just to show you how to choose the format for your application that you use for digital imaging. Again, my name is Vicki. I'm with Condi Systems. If you have any questions that pertain to this video or where to go from here, feel free to give me a call. Thank you for your time.